I'm going to call uh, Mustafa Abdel Wadud, our managing director, along with Tarek El Sadani, who Mustafa will introduce. Uh, this is this celebration has been leading to outcomes and to announcements. So we're going to have a quick announcement. Mustafa, Tarek El Sadani. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, we'll keep this uh, brief. Uh, Dr. Tarek Sadani is with the Ministry of Communications and Information Technology in Egypt. Uh, in the spirit of announcing outcomes, this whole festivity, this celebration of entrepreneurship is based on outcomes. And as part of what we're doing with Riyadh Enterprise Development, I think most of you saw the presentation earlier that Tom showed our initiative in terms of supporting small and medium enterprises and investing in those enterprises across uh, the region. There's a series of country funds, Egypt being one of them, and uh, we, we are announcing a fund for Egypt which is targeting around $80 million, in which uh, the ministry has been very supportive. They are coming in as partners, and as government are investing equity into the fund uh, to the tune of around $12 million. And I think very relevant for this uh, audience is they're actually earleafing part of their commitment in that fund for startups, IT-related startups and technology companies. So it is the one, one of the funds that will actually consider early-stage companies because they do have the infrastructure that will help screen such businesses. Uh, we're very grateful for that. We think they add a lot to the equation. Uh, that fund will look at SMEs in general. There will be approximately, in our view, given the kind of deal flow we're seeing from that specific country, probably a 30% or so waiting for IT and IT-related industries, including the specific allocation to uh, early startups. I'll give the microphone to Dr. Tarek. Thanks. Thank you, Mustafa. I appreciate it. Of course, uh, we at e in Egypt were very excited about the cooperation with uh, Abraj and Red and uh, being here. You know, uh, it's amazing because uh, very so very recently, like a month ago, uh, under the mandate of the Prime Minister of Egypt, we, uh, we set a new technology innovation and entrepreneurship center, which I'm fortunate to have. And uh, the mandate of the center is to promote the entrepreneurship in the country. Of course, we want to make sure a big part of the GDP of the country is coming from entrepreneurship, which of course is very aligned with what uh, we're doing all here and with a broad uh, mandate. So another exciting thing about this fund is also we are using some of the money from the OPEC, you know, which has been awarded to Abraj and Red to ensure, you know, the, the, uh, the, the also the Global Technology Initiative Fund from President Obama, we're using some of that money. The most thing that I'm very happy about is that due to the lack of the seed, as Mustafa mentioned, in the, uh, in the region, we, we together, we decided that the big, you know, a portion of this fund will go to the seed startup. We don't have here the idea of friends and family, so we want through this seed and through, you know, going and investing directly in our incubators and the small and uh, accelerators and the small companies. So we hope we, by sort of these, we will complete the whole equation for the uh, whole region. Thanks, Mustafa, and, uh, you know, we appreciate the cooperation. Thank you very much. We just wanted to thank them for recognizing the importance as a government of startups. Thank you very much. Thank you.